see the world changing. I can see it rearranging, happening before my very eyes. Okay. Either arm that you want to go ahead and get a pulse in. And I want you to raise your arm. Raise your arm. Other arm, sir? Just to prove that I'm ambidextrous. Okay, if you want, I could take off my boots and shut it down to the extremities. I quit doing it to the brain because my IQ kept lowering. You ready to fire it up, brother? Oh, it's not that hard to do. It's um, well, relatively simple. Once you learn a couple of quick tricks on controlling the muscles that surround the arteries. <coughs> Ready? <laughs> Smart enough. Keep firing it. what we do besides are we sane? Because the first question that everybody always asks is, do you have to be crazy to do this? You don't. It, it helps a lot, but you don't. I don't. <laughs> you got it now? Yeah. You sure, huh? Hey, Matt, get the drive up here. Get ask me for anything. Matt, break my skin. You want to stand before you for the bug. Okay? 20, 20, 25 years ago, we left Southeast Asia. A lot of people said we got whooped, but basically we got beat by the politicians. Okay? Since the, the early days of the war, the Hmong were our allies. Now, since we've left Southeast Asia, the Pat Lao, the communists of Laos, have been systematically exterminating the Mao in a, in a brutal war of genocide, including chemical weapons, heavy weapons, uh, now that the evil empire has fallen, they still have enough support. And what, what was the uh, population of the month 20 years ago? About a million and a half. About a million and a half months, 10, 15 years ago, they're down to about 300,000. Okay, they had to flee. Laos, many of them are living in a lot of communities in the United States. They don't want to live here. They want their country back. We want them to have their country back. This is the last freedom fighters in Southeast Asia. 
So what we're asking you to do is to donate, you know, and we're going to give you a show for it. Okay, on the truck. We want you to pledge by how far we can pull that truck. Has everybody signed a pledge sheet? Okay, anybody want to up their ante? Okay, how about, who, want, who would like to drive the needle through my arm? I have a bid on that? Yeah, we're going to spend 25 bucks right here. Oh, right here is 25. 25 there. He's in the needle. Bob's going to put through his arm. I'll go for 100. $100. We got $100 over here. Okay. bucks there. $100 for a needle. <laughs> what arm do you want? We're only bidding at one arm at a time. Right arm, left arm? Right arm. Right arm. $100 for the right arm. Do we have $110? Will somebody give me for his left arm? How about his right knee? How about his left knee? You know what's coming next. How about his weight? Okay, do we have do we have a bid on the left arm? Twenty-five again? Twenty-five dollars. We got any other higher bids? Hey, look, we'll take a picture. You can tell your grandchildren you stabbed me and got away with it. <laughs> I'll go 30 Bob. That's a good one. 30. 30 dollars. 35. 35. Yeah. 40. 40? 45. I'll go 50. I want to stick. 60 dollars. It's up to you, sir. 75. 75. Whoa, oh. big jump. I've known you a long time, but I don't know. <laughs> 80, 80 bucks, Bob. 80. Okay, we got 80. We have 85. 85 once, 85 twice, you bought it. Do I get to choose my needle? You get to choose your needle. Or no, maybe the other gentleman. Choose line. your weapon. What I want you to do is when you pull them out, I want you to bring them out with an axe and put their hands all over. <coughs> They're already sterile. No one's touching them. You came out of a sterile cat. They're so awesome. They're so awesome. Okay. Fire it up. Let's do it. Let's do it. That's right. Sit down. Gary, don't guide you through. That was a push. Drive it. It's not going to go through. You got one minute. Let's do it. We'll have guys stand by. I'm sorry, what? Bob! <laughs> they can donate afterwards, so they'll have people stand by. Star up the crowd. Here's the crowd up here, Bob. These are the people. These are the people. These are just. Do I have a microphone? Oh, yeah, we do. Where's the bullhorn? That's all right. Can y'all hear me? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you know, we have been supporting the child paw for many years. And this. This is a shit. Hello? <laughs> yeah. We've been supporting the SOM, we've been working with Fred and General Singlob and, and supporting the child FA for many years. And the reason we're doing this, and Bob Taylor is, well, making a sacrifice here. I sure as hell wouldn't do it. I offered to insert the needle in a certain part of his anatomy, but he didn't think that was too good an idea. But anyhow. We really, we really need your financial support. Uh, every dollar counts in, in, in helping these people. It's a, really the last anti-communist uh, freedom fighters movement in Southeast Asia. And so, uh, really, if, if there's any cause that you would want to donate to, this is certainly a worthwhile one. We want your support. Uh, Fred, what, what, what's your system here now of getting people to pledge? Uh, they're pledging by the foot. How many foot? You know, $5 per foot, $10 per foot to buy a full vehicle. Well, I'm, I'll, I'll give 10 bucks a foot. Thank you, Robert. So you can donate afterwards. Uh, any support that you can give us, we'd certainly appreciate. Thanks very much. And let's give a let's give a hand for Taylor, who's semi-crazy, and the child father who are fighting for freedom. Come on. Come on. Come on.
Thank you for coming to our backyard, and we hope you enjoyed the program.